The following is a morning walk conversation with His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on January 30th, 1977, in Bhubaneswara, India. By chance, everything is taken place. What is new that? Science. They don't say their work is by chance, hmm? but ultimately everything is by chance. What is it? But they are very good explanation. <laughs> Isaac Newton disproved that theory. Mm. Isaac Newton mm-hmm. disproved that theory. Mm. He did a paper called uh, "Life Has No Meaning." What's that? But the lifeless man was a meaning. We have to give life meaning, and that's the glory of man. They say that he finds the meaning, gives his own meaning to the meaningless. <coughs> life has no meaning. To get the Nobel Prize. <laughs> they say you should face up to that uncertainty or no meaning, and then just live your life. And that, without taking some meaning from the shastra or anybody, mm. you just simply take from him. Huh? Each each no. person has to find within himself meaning. Mm. Then why you are distributing money and take no let him. Do in his own way. Yeah. Why your ancestors give some money? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's the same idea as Krishna Morty. He don't yeah. need a guru, but he's written thirteen books to tell everyone. Yeah. Yeah, he's written thirteen books. Something like that. At the end of his book, he said, "When you're finished reading it, throw it away. Hmm? When you're finished reading this book, you should throw it away because huh. you don't actually need it." And that uh, philosopher of uh, of this philosophy, uh, Camus, he said, uh, "Don't try to lead me because I may not want to follow you, and don't follow me because I'm not capable of leading you. Just uh, walk beside me and be my friend." It's just, it's, so he said. By writing his books, he was not trying to lead other people, but just <coughs> trying to free them from from following falsely any uh, absolute philosophy. And he has to follow you because by taking your instruction, I shall stop following others. That means I have to follow you. Yes. So what is the benefit? If you stop following others, I have to follow you. My following is there. That is not stop. Mm. They claim they don't want to be leaders, but actually they do. That means that what he says that is contradictory. Mm. That means that <coughs> mm-hmm. But he commits suicide at the end of his life. Mm-hmm. Camus, yeah, he's a philosopher, he's a French philosopher, he commits suicide at the end of his life.
drive. You were asking yesterday what are some of the charges that the opposing party makes against us. Hmm. That's another one that uh, we follow absolute authority. Hmm. Your authority and also in the temples that the temple president or leaders, they tell they have authority. Uh, and this is not uh, healthy psychology that we should... Uh, Why you come to cause your authority? If other is not good, then why do you come to this stuff here? Mm. Again, eh? uh, change from one of the two But I don't say you have to accept me uh, absolutely as... Then why do you supposed to speak nonsense then? Mm. Somebody selling something. And if he says, don't purchase it, <laughs> then what is he <laughs> <laughs> After all their nonsense. They think that by surrendering to the spiritual master, if, if many people do this, it'll be very dangerous because they won't think for themselves. Yes, yes, sir, but... Uh... You ask to surrender to you. No, why shall I uh, not surrender to my spiritual mind? What is the use of changing? Surrender. Well, at least if we don't have uh, absolute authority, I may tell you something, and if it's not good, you don't have to follow me. Uh, because why do you speak nonsense? The same thing. If you haven't got to follow you. Why you waste your time? I know it's my time. If what he's saying has no value, then no value. why should he why, why do you waste your time? A relative value. Is that where Allah already got? And that's all there is, they say. Uh, already I've got the relative value. They say that each man has his own life to live, so he can take the best from which, from many authorities. He can say, well, I like some of what you're saying, and some of what someone else is saying, so I can take what's best for me, mm. for my life. But if I find in one place the best, I shall like, mm. yeah. take so much trouble. Mm. Why do you induce me to go mm. here and there? If I just, in one place, everything. <laughs> That's if what I like we everything found. you're saying, yeah. that if I like everything you're saying, then why should I accept that? Yeah. And why should they object if we decide to surrender to one authority? And they are asking surrender. They're actually envious because they want everybody to follow their idea of going here and there. One person said, this, this kind of thing reminds me of Hitler's Germany. If there's too much authority or blind following, it's not healthy. And too much authority, if the authority is wrong, but if the authority is right, then it is very better yes. to submit one in one place and get everything just like we go to some supermarket. We get everything there, we go there. And there's no question of blind following either. No. Otherwise, why would we distribute so many books? I went to one professor who refused to help us and he said, the reason is, although he, we may be being persecuted now and we're a small movement, by, by reading our books and talking to the devotees, he thinks that if we ever did become powerful, we would also become intolerant and we would not allow people to have any other uh, religion. So he said, although you're small, I am afraid to help you. He does not understand this. In the Vedic culture, are uh, people allowed to follow any other belief? 